expired. Are there any constituent statements by honourable members? I call the parliamentary secretary. Thank you, Mr. Acting Deputy Speaker. The best of Tumbarumba Shire was again on display on Saturday, February 1, as more than 80 people trekked 13.88 kilometres along the Human Hobble Track, taking in some of the region's rich beauty and diversity, some of Australia's best in this regard. Uh, started in 1985 by former Nationals Leader and Deputy Prime Minister Tim Fisher, Tumba Trek is steeped in the majesty of the natural beauty of Tumbarumba Shire and Australian political history. And now in its third year since uh, uh, I took over the reins from uh, and resumed the walk uh, from Tim Fisher. Uh, I was joined by uh, Federal uh, Indigenous Affairs Minister Nigel Scullion, uh, New South Wales Premier Barry O'Farrell. I can hear the member for Grainley. You're most welcome to come along, uh, Anthony Albanese, at any time. And certainly some, some high heavyweight uh, Labor figures have been on the trek as well. Uh, we all, we're also joined by Albury MP Greg Applin, as well as member for Wagga Wagga Darrell Maguire. Now, uh, the New South Wales Premier used the opportunity to encourage city people to travel to parts of regional New South Wales to see the beauty of our state, particularly in the Snowy Mountains, with uh, many attractions, a strong wine industry, as well as local motels and, and uh, sightseeing opportunities and proximity to major centres such as Wagga Wagga and Albury, uh, Mr O'Farrell said the Tumbarumba Shire is a great place for Sydney siders to spend their tourism dollar in the country. I would also argue that uh, uh, Victorian tourists are always welcome too. A strong contingent of local governments were also represented, with uh, Tumbarumba Mayor Ian Chaffee, uh, many Tumbarumba councillors joining in, as well as uh, Tamora Mayor Rick Furman and w Mayor of Wagga Wagga Rod Kendall. Uh, many locals also joined the trek, including students from Tumbarumba High School who are participating in the Tumbarumba 2 Kokoda program and will walk the Kokoda track on Anzac Day uh, 2015. They do this uh, in honour of Joseph Muggleton, a local boy who died in fighting with the 2nd 12th Battalion in Buna in 1943 at the height of the World War II uh, conflict in, uh, in Papua New Guinea. Uh, despite the heat, the 80-strong contingent enjoyed the, uh, the trek and were then treated to the hospitality of the uh, Tumbarumba Council for lunch, uh, as well as they received a commemorative medal. Uh, congratulations to all who participated, particularly uh, the uh, organiser, Marilyn Gilbert, uh, of the council. Uh, she does, always does a great job. And when you uh, go trekking along the human hobble track, uh, along places with such romantic names as Wild Mare's Gully, uh, the Coffee Pot Rest Stop, uh, Perro's Dam and finishing at uh, Paddy's River uh, Dam. It's always a wonderful, uh, wonderful trek to, to go on. Uh, certainly uh, Tim Fisher started this uh, back in the mid-80s and uh, you never knew what you were going to get with Tim. He uh, would often do a press conference uh, along the way uh, at the top of Mount Kosciuszko, which is uh, in the Riverina electorate. He would often uh, hold the press and tell them what was going on in the nation. It certainly brought the nation spotlight to Tumbrumba. I look forward to doing the trek again next year with the member for Graindler. Thank you, Mr. Act.